morning everybody we're now just left our campsite camping Tauro in Benicassim and we're on our way further south we can't book the next place we're going to and it is quite a busy area so we're not sure if we can get on any of the airs here but we are on our way down and we're gonna have a look aren't we? we are so we're proper winging it today um, but it's been nice to stop for three nights hasn't it I'm showers Showers are amazing there. If you ever go there, make sure you have a shower. Yeah, in the newer block, because that's the block that we were using, wasn't it? Yes. But yeah, really, it's really good showers. It's yeah, for glass doors. Glass. And this bloody idiot was stood washing the pots this morning and he didn't tell me he was dropping the van off the ramps, dropped the van off the ramps, and I banged my head on the microwave and we've got a lump on my head. Well, we are in Kelpie, but we cannot find anywhere to stop. Take Every air is rammed. The place itself is rammed. So we are on our way out and listening to the sat nav so we don't get lost. I booked us a campsite um, in Benidorm. <laughs> We're going back to Almafra for a couple of nights because. We're just getting a bit cheesed off trying to find somewhere to stop. It just seems to be rammed after you get past. But the, 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 the other reasoning in it is that there's a motorhome shop. There is a motorhome shop by, by El Racco, which we're going to in a week's time. Um, he's very English, so I might be able to fix the fridge. Fix the fridge. So, so we've got two nights on Almafra. That's where we're on our way to. But it's beautiful around here. I'm sad we couldn't stop. It's a bit stupid. Take exit to Avenida de la Deputation CV 746, then keep left. And we're just not wasting any more fuel driving around. All the air seems to be full. The campsites you have to rock up to, you can't seem to just book online. So we give up. Look how cool it is around there with all the buildings in the mountain. Yeah, it's pretty. Stop and it is like 20 degrees. I've still got my jumper on, <laughs> but I haven't got changed yet. I've not got a t shirt on underneath, so I have to wait till we get to where we're going. We're kind of looking forward to going back to Alma because we didn't spend a lot of time on site. Let me shut the window. We spent a lot of time on site last year, did we? There is one good thing with the, with the sites as well. Well, the sangria, yes, the sangria is lovely. So, we're going to sample the pool, the sangria. We're going to go to the camper Did shop. We, we had, had breakfast. Right. Yeah, we had breakfast there. And we're going to do the restaurant, I think. So, yeah. 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 <laughs> it's like a revisit tour this year, really. <laughs> <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> Lovely. Snotty steering wheel. Yeah, cool. re revisit tour this year. So, we're going back to Almafra. So, we'll pick you up when we get there. But currently, we're driving through all these pretty mountains. Beautiful. Good like you. Ah, thanks. Feeling all right. No. <laughs> We're both a bit hungry. It is two o'clock, and we've not hardly eaten anything. And we've been on the road since ten. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm packing. I'm hungry, and I need a cup of tea. But it's only twenty-three kilometres over there soon. How many smiles does it take to be happy? How We're in Benidorm. We are on our campsite at Camping Almafra. Uh, 
yeah, we're a bit further into the site than we were last year, aren't we? Yeah. Toilet sure. block is just there. Uh, we've got a view of the mountains over there. But it'll do for a couple of nights. Yeah. You want a hand? No, I do everything. <laughs> I have to do everything, you know what I mean? I thought my shoes had an LP. Our plan failed yet again. Camper shop is shut. It's Friday. It's open 9.30 till 1.30. Monday to Friday. Closed on a Saturday. And we're leaving on Sunday. So back to site it is. We're still a broken fridge. Good morning everyone from Benidorm. Stephen's just looking at what time we've got to be off in the morning. Um, I've had a frantic clean up this morning because I had an issue with my laptop last night and I didn't get to bed till 12 o'clock. I didn't even wash the pots, did I? No, you didn't. Unusual for me, that, innit? Very. <laughs> I don't like going to I bed. I bet you didn't sleep well because of it. Didn't. <laughs> I was up at seven, not washing the pots. I was up at seven trying to start my laptop, but thankfully it seems to be okay. Managed to get the video up for tonight, which is Saturday. It's 12 noon. 12 noon thought so so yes we've had an offer from a lovely friend of ours to have a look at our fridge so that's where we're headed tomorrow to meet them hey daisy um what's the matter she's very cuddly this morning i don't know what's up with her so we think we're gonna go on the tram to altea today don't we i think so yeah that's yeah the that's the plan because we don't want to do benidorm until we're in benidorm so there's no point in going down there so we'll do something different and my bum sore, I don't want to go back on my bike. Sorry. <laughs> You're being rude. No, it was my fault. You had to go out yesterday. Yeah, it was your fault. Sorry. Well, it's not your fault. The fridge is being broke isn't your fault. No, but <laughs> it, that's why we had to go back on the bike We went yesterday. to the, last you saw, I went to the camper shop and it was shut. So yeah, it's not going to, it's not going to be open till Monday when we're not here. So yeah, we'll go and meet our friends tomorrow and see if they can shed any more light on the subject than we can. So in the meantime, well, troubles with this bridge, yes, same, so. we'll get ready and go and get the tram. First tram in Spain, been on a bus, not a tram. <laughs> oh yeah, true, yeah. Maybe I just found the answers in you. made it on the tram to Altea as you can see I've had to go on the pocket because it's very windy today isn't it it's breezy so I've gone back to my old interview technique with the microphone <laughs> <laughs> oh god <laughs> BBC <laughs> BBC Susie <laughs> and we're just going past a fairly busy marina from the looks of it isn't it looks very busy not very small boats though no big ones no tiny boats yeah no big ones we don't know where we're going, we're just walking up the seafront because it's pretty. What do you say? That's more than our budget, that little one there. The little tiny one that will probably fit a child on it. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably not even in our budget to be fair. Well, with the one behind it. The one that you can't see, you can just see the bag on the engine. <laughs> well, the restaurant's getting ready for Christmas. We're kind of just wandering around aimlessly, we've got no idea where we're going. <laughs> Sure. Stephen's following his nose, I think, because he's hungry. Well, well, no, I've seen a thingy sign. Seen a thingy sign? Yeah. What's a thingy sign? Uh, urban no. The centre. Central sign for the centre. Yeah. Oh, they beer? do homemade lemonade. I don't know. Is it there? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I like homemade lemonade. We recognise this off somebody else's channel. <laughs> The travel trolls came here last year, I think. It's very busy down here, but it is Saturday afternoon, siesta time. happy we found a dessert place 
Now you're going to spend about 10 minutes looking at the menu, aren't you? Deciding what you're going to have. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So we decided to stop here and have food. Um, he's getting a massive sundae with three different flavours of ice cream. And I'm getting a salmon and Philadelphia crepe and a milkshake. So we're looking forward to that coming because we're both pretty hungry. And it is 10 past two. 10 past two already. 10 past two, we've hardly anything to eat. Pan of chocolate this morning, that was it. A cup of tea. We've got a super thanks as well. We would like to say a massive thank you to Paul Austin. Thank you so much, Paul. Really, really kind of you. We will get a beer, but we're probably going to wait till we go back to site because we're going to the restaurant there tonight. So we're going to have a sangria or two, aren't we? Oh, indeed. <laughs> indeed. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you. We really, really appreciate these super thanks. It's really, really kind. So that is Stephen's Sunday. That is ginormous. <laughs> Oh, that's your milkshake. No, oh, that's, that's your oh, sundae. sundae. Oh, win win. I think. Yeah, it's full of ice cream. Yeah, we'll be there. Yeah. And that is my strawberry milkshake. That's a pretty big milkshake. Let's see what it tastes like. Wow, that's very strawberry berry. <laughs> this is disgusting. It's disgusting. Really nice. <laughs> and here is my crepe. Yummy, yummy. I'm hungry. I'd say that was a very successful meal, wouldn't you? Yeah. Is it good? Very good. Very mm. nice. Stephen's just had a lucky, lucky man trying to sell him some underpants. Kelvin cleans. <laughs> They're not very pushy here. You just tell them no when they bugger off. So over there is the Rock of Kelpie, which we were trying to go to yesterday near there. But as you saw, we couldn't get on any of the airs. Um, Jam-packed. Yeah, absolutely rammed up there. But to be fair, Alma Fra <coughs> is so much more busy than it was last year. Yeah, you were talking to the reception. Talking to the reception, he says he's never seen it like this. He said it was really, really busy. So we're just going to have a quick look around the inner city bit, not the coastline, and then we get the tram back, aren't we? I think so, yeah. That wind's gold. So we're just having a quick stroll down the kind of the avenue that we came in on in the tram obviously a lot shut because it's siesta time but this road is well busy i'll take it's quite a busy place isn't it it is very busy here <laughs> but some of the shops are quite expensive shall we say those ones seem to be open funnily enough <laughs> While walking around Altea, we found this handcrafted market with some really beautiful jewellery. Take me away. I'm okay if I got you. We don't have to stay. We can do what we want to. Just give a little bit of your heart. Give a little bit of your heart to me. start to heal when I'm with you and I can't explain how I feel when I'm with you just give a little bit of your heart give a little bit of your heart to me just come give me all your love I want you to know we can make it together I saw that little craft market that I've just took you round. I had to do a voiceover because they had a load of Christmas music on. And it was in Spanish, but it probably will still pick it up in copyright. The um, It was like a craft handmade thing, wasn't it? I think so, yeah. I like picked it. up a bracelet because it was beautiful. I thought, oh, you know, maybe if it's 30, 40 euros, I might buy it for myself. 75 euros it was. I just can't justify spending that amount of money on my self on something pretty so i put it back but it was beautiful and she was making them there on the stall but i can't justify spending that amount of money on myself there's not enough money in the world says him that was going to buy a 200 quid pair of jeans if that's for me it's different why are you more important than me no <laughs>
have to come first. See so what I have to put up with. We're back at the tram stop. So we're going to discover which side of the tracks we need to be on and then get the tram back. I think it's due at 22 minutes past the hour and it's just gone three o'clock. So it gives us plenty of time to figure out where we need to go. Well, that's the tram successfully navigated. Kind of. <laughs> Two euros 50 each return, which is really good. But it's only two stops, about 10 minutes. We weren't sure if we were getting on the right one, but it is only one track. So even though Stephen was trying to have me on that we were going off in, up into the mountains because he's an idiot. <laughs> and he likes winding me up. And he can take bikes on there. So now I'm going to go and put arsenic in his cup of tea. Yeah, you can. It says that bikes and scooters are permitted throughout the network. There's a maximum of four per vehicle. There were more than that on there. <laughs> Probably in the summer. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I didn't know you could take your bikes on the tram. That's... Um, Worth noting. We've come to the bar for a drink. He's got John Smith. I've got Sangria. Cheers. Come to the restaurant for tea and they're playing Home Alone on the big screen. <laughs> Christmas movies. <laughs> well, we're not Home Alone, two other guys. So Stephen was wrong, it was Home Alone. I knew it was because I've seen it about 50 million times, but he's not a film person, so he's only probably seen it once. Do you enjoy your tea? Banging. <laughs> Banging indeed. Yeah, it was it good? was good. It was, work hard for. it was really good and it was only 21 euros for two meals and two drinks of coke so i thought that was very reasonable to be fair i was happy with that mm, me too i won't let him have a dessert he wasn't that happy with that but he did have a massive sunday this afternoon so i told him he's already had dessert today <laughs> he's having another one oh. there's chocolate in the fridge oh even better. don't eat all of it oh some of it's mine one piece what one piece is mine? Yeah. Well, you save the last piece that chocolate for the one you love. That chocolate will last me for ages and you'll devour it in five minutes. Well, that's the idea, isn't it? No. Oh, we've got a brew anyway, and more important things. Oh, yeah. I made him a brew about 20 minutes ago and he's I still could, not. Oh, drunk I didn't it. know. I've just seen your cup and I thought, I've got a brew. So, yeah, we're just spending the night oh. charging stuff up because we're going to be so, off just... grid, fingers crossed, for the next few nights um, if this fridge gets fixed. Yeah, I think it will do. So, yeah, um, it's been really nice to revisit Alma Fra, but we're off here tomorrow. Anyone want some of Susie's chocolate? <laughs> and, you know, tuck in, just as long as she's got one piece, because you, you always save the last Rolo for the one you love. So it's the same with chocolate. Anyone want a piece? Come on. No? Oh, right, I'll eat it then. Such a knob, isn't he? I buy myself one mm. thing, like literally one thing in the van that's mine, and he's mm. in it. <laughs> it's like having a five year old. Mm. Is there no one wanting <laughs> No, uh, last chance? No, I'll, I'll, I'll have your piece there. Yeah, you. Yeah, you watching this, I'll have your piece. Such a gamut. Yeah, so we're going to leave you for tonight, and uh, we'll put you back up in the morning just before we leave. Off to Alicante way, aren't we? Alicante, yes, Alicante. So, yeah, um, so I'll pick you back up in the morning, hopefully. I think I'm sunburnt as well. You are sunburnt. Yeah, sunburnt in December. Why am I not sunburnt? You just go from pasty white to white. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Uh, yeah, so I'll pick you back up in the morning, hopefully after a good night's sleep, because I'm tired after my crap night with my computer. <laughs> See you in the good morning, everyone. Moving, so we are heading down towards Alicante. Um, we have a week, six days, so we're back up in Benidorm. So six days, we're back, back on the Saturday, okay, yeah, Saturday the twenty, Saturday the twenty third. Saturday. My bad. Um, yeah, so moving day, and it's a bright sunny day. It's a little bit windy, but it's lovely. And there's the Benidorm skyline. So, um, we're probably going to end this video actually, aren't we? And start yeah, a new one. Yeah, may, may as 
well. New one where we turn up and who we're meeting. Keep left towards Alicant. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I will say thanks very much for watching. And everyone. it was nice to meet uh, oh. uh, the YouTubers next to us, him and her on tour him, yesterday. Him and her on tour. We ha I have met them before. Um, I met them at Willowfields. I do remember the lady. I don't remember the guy. Stephen doesn't remember anything from Willfield, so don't be offended. <laughs> so we say, thanks very much for watching everyone. Please remember to like, comment and subscribe. And big welcome to all of our new subscribers. Hi. Welcome. So we'll see you in the next one. See you later. See you later.